what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to some more full metal alchemist brotherhood i am definitely ready to jump into some more action here the final two episodes of the week for you guys episodes 47 and 48 man oh man are things getting wild in this anime um you know and i see the comments guys i really do see the comments um, actually recording this like a couple of days before it's going to be aired for you guys um, Friday uh, yeah Friday so we all know that if you is not dead right we know that that is not supposed to be surprising or, <laughs> or anything like that like I know the Fuhrer they're not gonna just kill off King Bradley just like just like that you know what i'm saying like it just wouldn't make sense story-wise to just kill him off just like that or to just you get what i'm saying it, it, maybe out of commission i would say because his body is pretty strong but you also could make the case that he could die in that explosion because he's more human than homunculus right so we could make that case but father is on the scene and I, as i said just don't hurt my baby, else I might have to come into the screen. You know what I'm saying? I might have to step on in and handle father by myself. You know what I'm saying? It, it's going to be a, a a fight, but, you know, uh, I'll try. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I got to I gotta show up, you know? Um, but one of the things that I noticed that nobody's answering the question and that's probably because you guys are not watching my review. I think I said it once in one of the episodes too where I was saying, where I was asking, does General Armstrong, does she use alchemy? I don't think so. It's my opinion. I don't think so, but you guys can let me know otherwise if she does because she was able to manhandle her brother that uses alchemy. I don't know if he used alchemy in the fight. I don't know if he was using alchemy in the fight because maybe he doesn't want to use alchemy against her. But at the same time, she's still badass, don't get me wrong. But I want to know if she can use alchemy or not. If she's the state alchemist too. They just haven't revealed that yet. Or she does. she's so good, she doesn't need to use it against bums. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because um, she didn't use any against... Um, I think his name is Raven. Um, I think it was General Raven, right? Um, she didn't use any alchemy against him. She just stabbed him and killed him. So it was like, it, it was kind of weird to me. But at the same time, I just want to know if she does or not. I don't think she does. But you guys can definitely let me know if she does or not. Okay? Definitely let me know that. I will really appreciate if you guys do that okay really appreciate if you guys do that so anyways let's jump into these reactions and i will see you guys for the review All right, so that was episode 47 and 48. We're getting closer and closer to the finish. I think there's less than 20 episodes left. Um, yeah, so we're getting closer to the finish, man. And wow, wow, those two episodes were very well done. Found out a couple of weaknesses for Pride, because I kind of, I mean, other than the fact that we know he was like in a container, you know that he has to be within that container like you know other than that we learned that you know light can be a, 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 a strength and a weakness if the light is too bright i mean if light is too bright if it's everywhere you can't really create shadows which is it it's it's just it's so weird how light works you get what i'm saying but there's so many things about light that is wonderful and there's also some very negative things about it also so it, it's the pros and cons man for everything is just it's just amazing to me it's it's amazing 
You know what I mean? And I really do dig it, man. But in any case, yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah, boy. Edward, you know, coming out with the Badao. You know what I'm saying? Going up against pride, pride eating gluttony. Like, that's so crazy. That's so crazy. But as I said, man, they're looking for Fuhrer's body. They can't find his body. And as I said before, I don't think he's dead. Um, there's no way they're going to kill off a character like that, you know, before the end. There has to be a showdown. There has to be a showdown with King Bradley. I don't know who I would want to see him fight or who I would like to see, like, finish him off. I don't know if, you know, old boy in the, from the flask, homunculus in the flask or whatever. I don't know if father is going to, like, take back all of the sins into his own body. And we will have, like, a showdown between Al and, and, and Ed against father. I'm thinking that maybe something like that is going to go down to end the series like as a final battle maybe it's going to be him against you know Owenheim um Al Ed and maybe Scar I don't know but it's going to take a lot to take him down and I, and I feel like maybe that's he's going to take back all the the, the sins philosopher's stone into his body and he's probably going to destroy greed and that's going to be sad because that's also Lynn. But at the same time, as I said, it might not go down like that. It might not. I'm just throwing theories out there of what I think might happen for like the final battle. Um, cause they're waiting on this eclipse. I still, we still don't know why he wants to do this. Why does he want to create, does he want to just open up the gate again? You know, is that it? You know what I mean? I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. But at least Owenheim is out there helping them recover right now. But also, Lanfan, she out here giving Gluttony the business. You know what I'm saying? But now Gluttony is dead again. So he's not in the picture anymore. Pride destroyed him, took his body, basically. So there's that, you know. So I'm looking forward to seeing what they're going to do next, man, because there's a lot of, there's a lot of stuff. I want to say stuff that I'm trying not to cuss because I was going to say the other S word. There's a lot of things about this, this anime that really has your brain really like trying to figure out what's going on or what's going to happen next, you know, based on stuff that we've seen before, because if you're if you're watching now from ep from episode one to now you get what i'm saying like there's so much stuff that you go back and be like you feel like you're watching an entirely different anime than you started watching you know what i'm saying it started out it was all about ed and al getting his body back and now there's so much more to the story than you you think you get what i'm saying that you would think like by episode 20 you know what I'm saying? That's not even the, the main situation anymore. You know what I'm saying? Um, from us finding out that, you know, King Bradley, the Fuhrer, is a freaking homunculus, that like he's wrath. From, from finding out so many different things about this story, this story has become so much more than them getting their body back, which I don't think they are going to get their body back. I think they're just, this is just how they're going to have to accept that they're living you get what i'm saying i don't think it's going to have that happy ending where al gets his body back or if if they do bring al back i don't think um i don't think ed is going to get his arm and his leg back i don't i don't think so so one or the other i don't think that it's going to be such a happy ending where everything that was established from the beginning of the story is going to work out in the end if this is going to be as great a story as i would want it to be and how i would write it to finish it up i would write it as a story where you know where you started out with a certain purpose and then you find out that that the sacrifice that you would have to make 
to fulfill that purpose is not one that you can morally make. You get what I'm saying? Like you can't make that decision on a moral standpoint of you would have to sacrifice souls to get that. And then you find, you find out that, you know what I'm saying? Like his dad wanted to sacrifice himself for them to get their body back. And you know, Ed getting his, his arm and leg back. But at the same time, he, he, you heard what he said. I'm not doing that. I'm not going to sacrifice so, so we can basically throw that whole philosopher's stone thing out the window because we know, know what it is. You know what I'm saying? It's a bunch of souls made into a, a, a bloodstone, basically. So, you know what I'm saying? So that's what a philosopher's stone is. So because of that, and because that's what they need, they might not need a philosopher's stone to actually get it back, but we'll see how it ends. I'm just saying, if I'm writing the story, Al doesn't get his body back. Ed doesn't get anything back, but you save the, you save the world. You save the country. You got better people in power because the homunculus is now out of the way and everybody can find a way to move forward because at the end of the day, that's life. You get what I'm saying? You don't always get what you want or, or what you set out to do or accomplish. And sometimes there's obstacles in the way that you can't get over that you would have to do some immoral thing to get over that obstacle. You just got to leave it alone or find it or try to find another way, even though it's probably absolutely impossible to you for you to find a way. And that happens. That's life. And you just got to move on with whatever it is and just accept that you'll never accomplish that goal. That happens sometimes. It doesn't happen all the time, but it does happen sometimes. So I appreciate you guys for tuning in as always, man. Um, thank you guys so much. Appreciate you guys. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, for all them people, for all you guys that are watching my reviews, don't worry, man. Some some nice things are coming that only you guys are gonna be able to be privy to and be able to get from me. I'm planning some good stuff for this holiday season, man. You know what I'm saying? planning some good stuff for this holiday season and they're gonna miss out for all you guys that are not watching my reviews on this channel man I, I i mean you're not watching it so you don't know even know that i'm saying this but it's all right <laughs> i got some things planned for all you guys that support the video and keep the watch time up um it's not a lot of y'all um you know what i'm saying that does that my watch time has gone down again and i'm not even gonna say nothing i'm not even gonna say nothing. i'm just gonna keep putting out content because it is what it is at this point it's just it, it is what it is so i appreciate you guys man thank you guys so much for going above and beyond and coming back to watch my reviews i appreciate y'all leave a like on the video and also leave a comment in the comment section i'll catch you guys later you guys have been killing it in the comment section um saying pride is trying to catch up with us because i think he watched the older version of just the full metal alchemist because um i know that there's two versions of the show like there was an older one and then they did full metal alchemist brotherhood and they improved some stuff maybe they did they changed some stuff about the story i don't know i don't know because i didn't watch the first one so i don't know <laughs> I don't know what they changed, but it's obvious that they changed things because even the title episodes, the title of the episodes are different because I got confused. I think the other day when I was looking up the titles to put it on my thumbnail and I was in the wrong list of the, um, the, the episode titles, I was in the wrong list. I was looking up just full metal alchemist and I didn't even realize, and I actually put out a thumbnail. I changed it now. I think it was for 41 and 42 that I had something like, and his name is unknown. That is from the original series. Like, you get what I'm saying? So even the titles are different from Brotherhood from the first series. So um, this is like a redo, like Hunter Hunter, right? If I'm not mistaken, correct me if I'm wrong, of course. But I do appreciate y'all, man. See you guys when we get back. Peace. <laughs>